Hello everyone welcome to back my channel, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Tonight was the second week of live performances on this season of AGT, and the judges made it clear that they were looking for strong competitors. Unfortunately, Howie, 67, wasn't happy with the Sharp family's live performance. The family of six sang a version of the popular song Carry On My Wayward Son. Before the performance was complete, Howie smashed his buzzer and gave the family a big red X. Once the song was over and the audience had an opportunity to share their opinion, they took the opportunity to boo the former gang show host. When he could finally speak, Howie said, Tonight, only two acts are going through, and I went from a Super Bowl to a cruise ship. He was referencing the previous performance from the Atlanta Drum Academy, who all of the judges believed should perform at the Super Bowl. He also said it felt corny and outdated. Sofia Vergara, 51, agreed and said, I felt like I was in a church service. Simon, 63, then chimed in and said, You're very wholesome. Very apple pie, cherry pie, peach pie, whatever. I think for me, I think it was a terrible song choice. He went on to say that some of their facial expressions were over the top, and the crowd started booing at him too. H-O-R-E, Tubo, D-I-S-A-G-R-E. Fans of the television show on X, formerly known as Twitter, completely disagreed with Howie and Simon. One said, So far on hashtag AGT, the Ed Sharpie singers are the best of the show. Their harmonies are so much better than obnoxious drumming. Another said, if you don't like an act, Howie, you could at least be kind and clap when they're finished. They work hard to get here, at least give them that. A third said, at Howie Mandel, you have no idea of what talent is. Incorrigible attitude. Someone said, stop it with the negative comments about musical theater, Howie and Simon. Those people know how to sing and sing well, so STFU. A fifth said, Oh wow! That harmony for Carry On My Wayward Son is actually really good. The ending note, a bit too high there, I think that that's okay. During last week's live show, Howie came after Sophia for her new status as a divorcee. It came after a contestant named Brain Cummings, a 12-year-old ventriloquist, performed. Her act was based on her puppet and how the pink skunk wanted to find love. Bryn had several potential animal suitors for her puppet, and she asked Heidi Klum, 50, to pick the best one. But after the performance was over, Howie had another idea. He told Bryn, You're adorable and you blend magic and ventriloquism and you deserve to be here. He continued, if I have one word of advice, if you're looking for eligible bachelors, you should have talked to Sophia because she's in the market right now. The modern family actress recently got divorced from her husband, Joe Manganiello. The show's host, Terry Crews, came out from behind the stage and scolded the judge for his mean comment. But Sophia didn't seem to mind Howie's jab as she threw her hands up and yelled, Yeah. Simon Cowell and Howie Mandel furiously booed by AGT fans after judges slam family singing group as outdated and corny. America's Got Talent, AGT, is known for showcasing a wide variety of acts, from incredible acrobats to jaw-dropping magicians and heartwarming singers. But not all performers receive a standing ovation from the judges or the audience, especially when longtime panel members like Simon Cowell and Howie Mandel are involved. Their brutal honesty has become a staple of the show, adding an element of drama that keeps viewers hooked. However, a recent episode took that drama to a whole new level when both Simon and Howie were furious booed by fans after they harshly criticized a beloved family singing group, labeling their performance as outdated and corny. This particular episode showcased a range of talent, but it was the appearance of a close-knit family singing group that captured the hearts of the live audience right away. Dressed in matching outfits reminiscent of a classic 1950s variety show, the group exuded warmth, positivity, and charm as they took the stage. It was clear they had spent years honing their craft together, 
singing harmonies that were pitch perfect and delivered with precision. The family's performance was an energetic medley of classic songs, taking the audience on a nostalgic trip down memory lane. With coordinated dance moves, bright smiles, and wholesome family values, their performance seemed to embody everything that AGT is about, bringing joy to audiences and showcasing unique talents. But despite the glowing reaction from the live crowd, Simon Cowell and Howie Mandel were less than impressed. Simon Cowell's Brutal Critique Simon Cowell, notorious for his blunt and often cutting remarks, didn't waste time in delivering his critique of the performance. After letting the applause die down, he leaned back in his chair with a look of disapproval on his face, clearly unimpressed. I'm going to be honest here, Simon began, I just don't get it. This feels like something you'd see on a cruise ship or in a theme park, not in a competition that's looking for the next big star. It's outdated, and to be frank, it's corny. The live audience, who had been cheering just moments earlier, reacted immediately with a loud chorus of boos. Fans who were moved by the family's heartfelt performance felt Simon's critique was unnecessarily harsh. He continued, unfazed by the crowd's disapproval, explaining that while the group had talent, their act belonged to a bygone era and lacked the modern appeal that AGT is looking for. You're talented, no doubt about that, Simon added, but talent alone isn't enough. You need something fresh, something people want to pay money to see today, and this isn't it. The audience grew louder in their protests, but Simon remained steadfast, defending his position. For him, AGT is about finding acts that are not only talented but also marketable, and in his opinion, the family act did not fit that mold. Howie Mandel's take, not far behind. Following Simon's critique, Howie Mandel, another long-standing AGT judge known for his comedic approach and quirky personality, offered his thoughts, though they were no less critical. While Howie is typically more lenient with family-friendly acts, this time he sided with Simon's evaluation, doubling down on the outdated label. I agree with Simon on this one, Howie said. You guys are talented, and I can tell you love what you do, but I think this is something that belongs in a different time. It's charming, but it's not what's going to win this competition in 2024. It's too cheesy for today's audience. The audience erupted once more, booing both judges with an intensity rarely seen on the AGT stage. Some fans even stood up, waving their arms and shouting at the judges in defense of the family group. It was clear that the viewers in the theater disagreed with Howie and Simon's assessment. Seeing the families act as a breath of fresh air amidst the often edgy performances featured on the show. Fans react, outrage on social media. As the episode aired, the backlash quickly spread beyond the AGT stage and onto social media, where fans expressed their outrage at the judges' treatment of the family singing group. Twitter exploded with comments, many criticizing Simon and Howie for being too dismissive of an act that embodied positivity and nostalgia. One fan tweeted, Simon and Howie need to realize that not every act has to be modern or cool. Some of us love seeing wholesome, talented families perform together. They were robbed of the recognition they deserved. Another fan added, I get that AGT is a competition, but calling them outdated and corny was just rude. There's an audience for everything, and the judges totally misread the room tonight. Some users even tipped to Instagram, sharing clips of the family's performance alongside captions praising their talent and criticizing the judges' harsh words. Memes quickly circulated, with some poking fun at Simon's reputation for being overly critical, while others lambasted Howie for not standing up for the family group. The family's reaction, Grace Under Fire. Despite the overwhelming negative reaction from the judges, the family group remained composed and gracious. After hearing Simon and Howie's critiques, the group's leader, a father figure who had clearly poured his heart into the act, thanked the judges for their feedback. We appreciate your honesty, he said. We love performing together as a family and we'll take your advice to heart. This experience has been incredible for us and we're just grateful for the opportunity to share what we love with the world. 
their response only endeared them further to the audience, who cheered even louder in support. The family waved to the crowd as they exited the stage, visibly moved by the warmth and encouragement from the AGT fans, a divided panel. While Simon and Howie were firmly against the act, the other two judges, Heidi Klum and Sofia Vergara, had more positive things to say. Heidi, always a fan of feel-good performances, was quick to express her disagreement with Simon and Howie. I think you were fabulous, Heidi exclaimed, to the delight of the audience. Not every act has to be cutting edge or modern. There's something timeless about what you do, and I loved it. Sofia Vergara, similarly charmed by the family's wholesome energy, also defended the group. You brought something beautiful and joyful to the stage, she said. It's not about being trendy all the time. Sometimes it's about connecting with people, and you definitely did that tonight. Their supportive comments were met with thunderous applause, creating a clear divide among the judges. It became evident that the panel was split not only in their opinions on the family's performance, but also on what AGT should stand for, whether it should prioritize marketable, modern acts or embrace a broader spectrum of talent, including those that evoke nostalgia. The broader debate. What does AGT represent? The controversy surrounding this family singing group's performance sparked a larger conversation about what America's Got Talent truly represents. Over the years, AGT has evolved from a show that featured a wide variety of acts, some quirky, some polished, into a platform where many expect to see the next viral sensation or Las Vegas headliner. But for many viewers, the essence of AGT lies in its celebration of all kinds of talent, regardless of whether it fits the mold of modern entertainment. Some argue that Simon and Howie's comments reflect a growing focus on commercial viability over genuine talent and heartwarming performances. Critics of this shift suggest that AGT risks losing its charm by prioritizing acts that are seen as cool or marketable rather than those that connect with a broader, often nostalgic, audience. On the other hand, some defend Simon and Howie's critiques, pointing out that AGT is, at its core, a competition. They argue that while the family group was talented, the judges were simply being realistic about what it takes to win in today's entertainment landscape. Conclusion the furious booing of Simon Cowell and Howie Mandel after their critique of the family singing group serves as a reminder of the deep emotional connection that viewers often form with acts on AGT. While Simon and Howie may have seen the performance as outdated and corny, the audience, and a large segment of the viewing public, viewed it as a refreshing, heartwarming display of family talent. The backlash they faced both in the theater and on social media highlights the ongoing tension between modern, market-driven entertainment and the nostalgic feel-good acts that continue to resonate with many AGT fans. As the show progresses, it will be interesting to see how this debate shapes future performances and judging decisions. Will AGT continue to lean toward cutting-edge, contemporary acts, or will it find a way to balance the old with the new? giving all kinds of talent the chance to shine. Only time will tell. Thanks for watching this video and please subscribe our Update World 24 YouTube channel for more update news.